Chairman of the Zenit Labour Party, ZLP, Dan Mwanyang, has called on the Nigerian Labour Congress to insist on the 30,000 Naira minimum wage demand. Mwanyang, who stated this in a media parley in Abuja today, added that the Nigerian workers are the engine room of the economy, so deserves more. It is very shameful that our governors are now negotiating minimum wage as if they are pricing pepper and tomatoes in our charger market. We are talking of the wages of those who create the wealth they squander. These are the creators of wealth, the workers. The only one, the most patriotic group in Nigeria, they pay their taxes, they work assiduously to get the economy moving. So Zenith Labour Party is in support of Nigerian Labour Congress in its demand for 30,000 Naira minimum wage without less. And the nation should not succumb. The argument that they cannot pay is not true. It's not true. How much do they pay their special assistance? Special assistant to special advisor to special this. How much? All they need to do, somebody will now tell me, look at the num numbers. Yes. They can cut down expenses. If you cannot pay, go and tell your workers that you cannot pay. You cannot pay 30,000 naira. If you're working in Abuja, for example, the minimum you spend on transport to work in this city from wherever you are coming is 17,000 naira. And they're shamelessly saying to 2,500. I think enough should be enough. Workers should be ready to force this demand democratically and in line with best practices of labor management relations. Energy should not yield. Government can pay 30,000 naira. Why is it that all over the years, since this issue of minimum wage started in the 80s, when we fought for it, why is it that governments find it difficult to agree on minimum wage without the fight? But these people are the people who create the wealth. They make the money. They are the most cheated in the economy. Yes, the most patriotic. So we are in support of Nigerian Labour Congress demand because most of the workers who are members of this party are suffering. They have sent signals that they will be part of the demonstration. And Zenith Labour Party will mobilize some opposition political party to be part and parcel of that struggle of Nigerian Labour Congress and Trade Union Congress. Government can pay 30,000 Naira minimum wage to Nigerian workers. We have the resources. All it requires is better management of resources, cutting down expenses, doing away with overbloated contracts. On the current killings of some shite protesters across Abuja during the week, Wanyang urged the government to engage the aggrieved protesters to prevent any further killings of unarmed citizens. Government should on its own part carry out its responsibility of engaging them. Engage them. We should come down from our high horse. We should swallow our pride and arrogance and engage them. They are citizens of this country. I'm told that those groups are up to 7, 10 million of our population. Why ignore them? Why ignore them? The appropriate agencies of government, or even Mr. President, should direct for them to engage them in discussions. They have leaders, and these leaders are known to government. Wanyang assured Nigerians of the Zenit Labour Party's commitment of a better and peaceful Nigeria if elected into power in 2019. Iwe Sekunde, reporting for ZT News.